Hi, I'm Dr. Jim Gray. I'm the Chief of Staff at the Cheyenne VA Medical Center and... I'm Sabrina Atkins and I'm the Nurse Executive. Sabrina and I have been talking about the things that we need to address or think about with this current COVID-19 pandemic. Uh, most of you have heard all the advice already, but let's reiterate the basics. Wash your hands, wash your hands, wash your hands. It's very effective at disrupting the coating on the virus. You need to wash your hands for 20 seconds. Last time I heard, if you sing happy birthday to yourself twice, that's good enough, but wash your hands multiple times. And then there's social isolation. Um, you need to keep a distance of at least six feet from other people, but we're getting into a time where there's a lot of this disease around. So our advice is stay away from crowds, stay away from people just as much as you can. This won't go on forever. We'll get through the worst of it over the next several weeks, maybe a couple of months. And during that time, you just need to stay as far away from people as you can. Now there's the issue of masks, right, Sabrina? Yes, and um, so let's talk about masks. In the very near future, probably starting tomorrow, when you come to our facility, you will see many people in masks. It's not because we're ill, it is just to protect those around us. So when you come in and we ask you to put on a mask, it's not that we're afraid of you. It just means that we are trying to protect those around you. But let me show you something. You've seen many of these on the internet. These are cloth masks that you can make for yourself. If you go to the CDC website, um, they can show you how to make one out of a scarf, bandana, or something like that. It's great to wear to the grocery store or to the pharmacy for those errands that you have to run. But again, thank you for your service. Thank you for um, coming to our hospital and um, let's mask up.